Hello ladies and gentlemen, Ji Yong here and I am proud to introduce to you guys my new channel, Young Plays. This is a subdivision of the nation solely dedicated to playing games. Now before I can launch this channel, I do need to know there are enough people out there interested. Amongst the 25,000s currently enlisted in our nation, if just a thousand of you subscribe to Young Plays, if a thousand individuals are interested in watching me play some games, then it is indication enough for me to start shelling out some high quality and entertaining content. I usually don't do this kind of minimum requirement thing, but the reason I have to do this is because in order to get a secondary channel partnered on my current network, Curse, I have to get up to at least a thousand subscribers. Having the channel partnered means having access to exclusive features that will allow me to give you guys the best entertainment experience possible. So, if a thousand of you guys would willingly subscribe to enjoy some awesome Let's Play content, then Young Plays will be set to go. For those who have watched my previous Let's Play attempts, here are some changes and improvements you can expect. 1. Appropriate Video Length from now on, I will record hours of footage at a time, footage which I'll split into appropriate sized pieces. So this means you will not hear an intro in every video, but this will allow me to record Let's Plays much more efficiently. 2. The removal of face cam. Honestly, it's more trouble than it's worth. It always goes off sync, it is a bit of a pain in the ass to set up, and it is just not absolutely necessary to make awesome Let's Plays. The feature may return eventually for specific styles of games like horror, in which you want to see my face, and maybe after I find a better setup, but for now, no face cam. Not having to deal with the extra editing also means being able to render and upload episodes faster. 3. Frequent and consistent uploads, being able to record hours of footage to evenly divide and not having to deal with the hassle of face cam, both contribute to faster and more efficient recording and editing, which also means faster and more efficient uploads. 4. Improved audio. Previously, I had my Blue Yeti microphone on a stand in front of my keyboard on the desk. This meant that while I played a game, you could hear thumping noises from my key presses due to the vibrations emitted by my desk. Now, I have a new setup utilizing a swivel arm, a shock mount, and a pop filter, removing unnecessary noise, keyboard noise will be vastly reduced, and the annoying and bassy thumps from desk vibrations are gone for good. 5. Capture Card A capture card, for those who don't know, is a device that allows you to capture footage from game consoles, and I've always wanted to play and review game console exclusives for you guys. I am soon going to purchase one of these capture cards, and will soon start doing Let's Plays for console games. 6. Last but not least, playing important games after I finish them. I have a confession to make, and I don't want you to take this the wrong way. When doing Let's Plays for games like Skyrim and Far Cry 3, games that I really looked forward to and cared about, while I enjoyed making the videos, I found myself not enjoying the games as much. I love video games way too much to not play them properly, you know, in an environment that feels natural and one in which I can immerse myself without distraction. Video games are art to me, and to enjoy art, to absorb and enjoy these games, I have to get into my own little bubble. So, while I love doing Let's Plays, let's face it, having to constantly talk and make sure the audience is entertained while playing a game just isn't the optimal way to enjoy games for the first time. Once I play through the games once, however, I can easily play them a second time, perhaps at a higher difficulty, and still enjoy the game again while talking to the audience. So from now on, any games that I deem important to me, I'll play, finish, and review first, and then replay them on Yong Plays. So, with a more efficient system that will allow me to upload content consistently while retaining quality and while improving my enjoyment of the games, I can guarantee you guys that you guys will have a great time over at Yong Plays. One more thing I need from you guys, apart from a subscription, is to let me know in the comments below what games or kinds of games you'd like to see me play in the near future. Don't try to just include AAA multi-million dollar games, don't be afraid to shove at me some indie games or smaller fun games. I want to try a little bit of everything if possible. So, I hope you guys are excited as I am about this new venture, and I hope you'll come over to Yong Place to enjoy some awesome and entertaining content. So what are you waiting for? Click that subscribe button and let's play some games. I'll see you guys there. Thank you very much, and Yong out!